So let's start off with 2023. And now there's going to be more newest N64 games that are might be coming to the Nintendo Switch. This time, let's talk about one of the Nintendo 64 games that people recommend wanting to have on the Nintendo 64 Nintendo Switch Online. What's up everybody, Danny's here, back at it again with another video, but before we get into it, make sure you check out all the links in the description below. Right off the bat, we wanted like some N64 games to come onto the Nintendo Switch. I know last time we had like Mario Party 1 and 2 for the N64, but there's like Mario Party Superstars on the Switch and Super Mario Party. But let's get into this. The N64 was released in 1996, 26 years ago. With Super Mario 64, GoldenEye 007, The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, I think GoldenEye 007 will be a nostalgia hit for the Nintendo Switch. And also Super Smash Bros. And now, I don't know why Nintendo hasn't released GoldenEye this year. But I'm hoping they will do that eventually, or even in 2023. And now, when I see... Nintendo, like, not releasing GoldenEye 007, but it might be releasing sooner. Like, what they announced it in the last Nintendo Direct, that is what they've announced lately on the Nintendo Direct, on the Nintendo Switch Online expansion pack, but GoldenEye 007 might be able to come out in 2023. The same way you think, it's like a first-person shooter game, GoldenEye 007, which is released 25 years ago on the, on the Nintendo 64, almost said the Nintendo Switch, but right off the bat, Legend of Zelda Majora's Masks is now 22 years old. It's kind of like the best Zelda game, just like The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And as I know, as I can tell right now, but a lot of people want GoldenEye 007 on the N64 earlier. And you know what? Nintendo might not release it this year. But personally, I don't believe they think they would delay GoldenEye 007. And not releasing it. I would see that. Because if they did this. Like in 2023. Like what they did with The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild 2. And even the Super Mario Brothers movie. This would be like. Have like a bad time for everyone all around. Which would stop people from wanting. I mean, to get it early. To get something that's released earlier. Which would stop them. From like. Releasing it earlier. And you know what. The number one reason. It is like delayed and it's supposed to come out like next year, but I'm hoping they might work on it. But I think Goldeneye 007 can be a massive success on the Nintendo 64. I've mentioned that 2022 is starting to come to an end soon. I know 2023 has starting to come sooner, but Goldeneye 007 will be releasing on the Nintendo Switch soon. And you know what? You had to pay like $60, but if you want to play the Nintendo 64 games, you have to subscribe to the Nintendo Switch Online Expansion Pack. It depends on the plan you have and which plan is right for you. So that is a prettier, steep barrier of entry. And you know what? GoldenEye 007 might come out next year. Now imagine Nintendo announcing GoldenEye 007, or anybody can like play GoldenEye 007 while it comes out sooner. Plus... If you guys love the N64, it is really a nostalgia hit. And you know what? So there could be a massive success if Nintendo releases GoldenEye 007. It could be a gigantic success if GoldenEye 007 was released yet. But there's some other Nintendo 64 games we want other than a Super Mario game. But you know what? We just still have tons of Mario games. And I don't understand, though. But I do understand, of course. And now, as much as I know, Nintendo might delay GoldenEye 007. It might be coming out in 2023. But, you know, what? it has, like, so many good games. So many great games like Mario Kart 64, Zelda Majora's Masks, Ocarina of Time. And Super Mario 64, though. And even, like, Paper Mario, Banjo-Kazooie. But, you know what? The Nintendo Switch might release GoldenEye 007 on the Switch sooner. To get more people to check this game out. GoldenEye 007. And it just has like all the piece. It just has like all the games that Nintendo has time for it. But it might release in 2023 though. If you made it this far. Thank you very much. 
Maybe if they see this video and they see how many people want it, and it to be released earlier, they will actually release it in December on the Nintendo Switch this year or even in 2023. So make sure you guys hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. Leave a comment. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll talk to you all next time.